Hey guys, Zenith here. Wanted to talk about what in raid bots, what stat weights are and how you use that tool. So it's another guide for the raid bots. So if we're just going to go, we'll hit right into it. Stat weights, what does this do? Well, online you can look up, hey, what are my best stats for, for example, I'm on my alt as an arms warrior. What are the best stats for arms warrior? And you can pull those up online and you can see the generic ones. It'll say, oh, you want to prioritize crit and mastery or whatever uh, that's not necessarily accurate but i that's just an example so is that really true does that always apply and this is what we're going to look at by using stat weights you can determine that information so as always we're going to run a sim c slash sim c copy we're going to take that over and paste into the stat weights area We've got our regular simulation information, and we're going to generate stat weights. And as it runs this information, it's going to determine what actually is your number one stat that you should be focusing on based on the current gear you're wearing. Now, every time you get a new piece of gear, you want to run a new stat weight because it's going to offset what is priority. Weapon damage is obviously number one for Arms Warrior especially. Then it's prioritizing haste, 2.18%. Crit. 2.05%, versatility, 1.96, and so forth. So what are the highest stat priorities? Now we can know, for our character, this is the most important stats we want to look at right now. So we also want to talk about conjunction using pawn, using this information. So we see here there's a pawn string. We can copy this, Control-C, and we can use it with a tool called pawn, P-A-W-N. It's an add-on you can get in the game. So if we go into World of Warcraft and we type in slash P-A-W-N, it'll pull up Pawn. Now, in Pawn, you want to set it to Manual. So under Scale, you'll choose Manual. And that allows you to import your specific stat weights for your character. So I've imported these, but we'll just go ahead and we'll use this one here, this, this profile, and we'll choose Import, and we will paste and hit OK, and it puts all that information in there. How is this beneficial for me? Well, you get a piece of gear that drops. And when it drops, you can see, hey, look, there's an upgrade arrow, a green arrow. Looking at it based on the patchwork raid bots input, that's actually a potentially an 8% upgrade for my character over probably my second best ring, which is this one, this 355 ring. So you can see, first it says here, your best is... Not that one. This one is your second best. This one is my best, according to both. Um, this old, there's an old pawn information that I haven't deleted yet that's on there. But so we can determine that now. Of course, this is just a quick and easy way to see uh, what's upgrades and what's not upgrades. Ultimately, you still want to take it in and sim it to really determine how much of an upgrade a piece of gear is. But pawn's just a great tool to give you a quick like get a piece of gear and there's a green arrow on it you can go hey that's that might actually be an upgrade and then you can you can put it into sims and actually determine how much of an upgrade it truly is so that's how you use the stat priority on raid bots and hope it helps you guys good luck